people always ask why are Mercedes more successful than others at the moment. The speed to insight is really important. You know, the faster we can come up with a conclusion, the faster we can make a decision, the faster we can extract learning, the faster we can make the car. And that's really key to what we do in, in Formula One. And it's about giving our people the tools to make those decisions using the Tibco Spotfire software. The dyno is a testbed which replicates all the environmental conditions that components would run through. We allow the designers to take them right to the edge, knowing full well that that component can be tested on the dyno before it goes to the track, and that gives them confidence to really push the limits of, of their designs. The regulations have continually evolved. Now you can only have three engines for the year. Additionally, gearboxes have to last six races. We get a lot of data. There is just too much to look at, so it's, it's really important to cut through that and, and find out the important stuff. Botfire allows us to quickly filter on that data, capture the failure before it happens, just as a component is starting to fail, rather than trying to look at something after it has catastrophically failed and removed all evidence of what actually happened is really important. So the more efficiency we can find in any area on the powertrain, that equates to extra power. All the work that we're doing on the dyno is giving us a competitive edge by finding those small amounts of performance that make a difference. Whereas before, if somebody said, you know, I can bring in a system and you can log another 3,000 channels of data, that's great. I'm never going to look at it though. Uh, whereas now I know that we can. I look after the capability and methodology that we use here in the wind tunnel. In 2019, there was a large change in the regulations governed by the FIA for the aerodynamic components on the race car. The challenge is to deal with those changing regulations through our aerodynamic understanding using the tools and capability that we have in the department and to bring back all that performance that we've lost. We will capture large volumes of data in the wind tunnel. TIBCO brings to us a wealth of experience in the mathematical analysis of large data sets. Moving forwards, we hope that the partnership with TIBCO is going to enable us to make decisions using the large volumes of data that we create in the wind tunnel in a smarter and faster way. The power of data analytics and machine learning should hopefully unlock future aerodynamic potential. I think some of the things that we learn in Formula One are definitely applicable to other industries about that speed of learning and how you can turn that into, in our case, lap time. In the case of other businesses, that might be into products and return of sales on those products.